spicy. Play this is nice. good game, peeps. Ladies and gents, Slash Chief has been getting a lot better. If we had a if we had a prize for most improved. Oh my god. Oh my god. And it doesn't even kill. Oh, but that kill. Yeah. You see that giant combo that went all the way across the stage? Didn't kill. Jab down strong, easily kill. <laughs> I love the coverage of the down strong from Garfield though. Oh yeah. He's got like that weird disjointed thing, so it hangs from my ledge. I heard the some people want to nerf it or something. Uh -huh, that but I think that's end. I think that's a low priority. Um, <laughs> I think there are definitely characters that are more of a oh wow, that'll kill. That was bad DI or something. Maybe. To be fair, like if you get hit, oh, okay, that was bad DI. Mm. Um, to be fair, they like when press you... up. I'm not sure, but I think when you play on, um, name, 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 Sweet Dreams, uh, you think you have a lot more room to recover because of how wide the box is, and then you just get caught out by it. True. Not I... on like that. Oh wow, that'll kill. Oh yeah, the PTM snare. That'll get ya. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like I... a lot could have killed that percent though. Deep uh, I Garfield that... is surprisingly heavy. Um, yeah. So from center stage, oh. you'd be surprised. But PTM snare will definitely will kill anyone from anywhere on stage. It's just an outrageously strong move. It, it's funny because when people saw the nerfs to PTM's up strong in the air, people were like, oh god, PTM's just not going to be good anymore. But then they just realized has been improving a lot. They've been using their shine more, and this yeah. is a good thing to see. But I do think they use that down there too much. Um, I think it's well, when it's when you're doing it too much, it's less of an issue in the move just being stronger, like good or bad. It's more just like if your opponent is able to read you so hard that you just get caught out, caught yeah. out, caught out. Yeah. It's I a good a... option to approach, definitely. It has a huge hitbox and it's fast, but you can't just do one thing in neutral. It was, a, it, was a it was a fantastic first stock for TMZ, though. Oh, oh yeah, that's um. Yeah. Oh, just. Oh. That move is ridiculous. It should not combo into itself as easily as it does. You feel, you feel like a complete numpty oh. getting oh, oh. thrown at you on stage over and over again. And just, just an entire oh, stock of keepy uppies. That was not a profitable trade. That was the worst trade deal in the, the history spike. of trade. The spike is clean. Oh, you love to see it. I mean, I mean, Slav don't, but, you know, we love to see it. <laughs> yeah. I mean... One thing that Slav... I've, oh. I've, son, I've seen them talking and um, asking questions in the Grinders Court uh, about how to, like, do the bait and punish thing more often. Ooh. One thing they need to learn is, like, I think they should have, like, more patience. Because they just run at you. Um, they need to know that they can just sit on one side of the stage sometimes. <laughs> It's, it comes with the territory of being Powdered Toast Man, you know, he doesn't just stand around and wait. He jumps stand on in, the other side of the stage, in. charge your croutons and dash dance. Ooh, that was a great stock from Slap there. And if you like, see, uh, oh yeah, and, and if you see an opening, you can go in with the down air, it's a good option. Um, but it's, you don't oh have to move Slab has still been like on that grind, finding whoever they can, learning what they can with PTM, and it's honestly really impressive to see how much they've improved in the coming months. Yeah, anyway. So, so on Jellyfish feels in TNT yet again with the juggling act. I mean, at least it's like trading into each other, that like getting a decent amount that of move, That move, that's why you never take Garfield. Oh! The Jellyfish. <laughs> to, to a... Oh wow. Oh god, I hate it when that happens. Getting killed by a clean pie is just completely soul crushing. But anyway, as I was saying, that donut move is why you never take Garfield to a stage without platforms. Um, if you take Garfield to a stage without platforms, you are just going to get hit by that move over and there is no escape. Especially as Reptar. Um, you will just. Oof! I think yeah, that was an accident up B, which is unfortunate because the uh, the pie reflect there. That would have been amazing if they could have capitalized on it. Yeah. Whoa.
recovering above ledge. Not, not so. Okay. Well. You see not that so uh, well. Slab was trying to snare in order to RPS the, uh, <laughs> you know, to RPS the upstrike from TNT, but I think they landed on a platform before the hitbox came out and it sort of screwed them over. I, I have to highlight the message in chat that says NV Pi. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> Oh, hey, this one's like chained into each other, it's just a nightmare to go against, especially on the stage like Here's this. Here's one thing that Slav is doing. They seem to be doing down strong, following on TNT with down strong a lot. At this percent, it really makes more sense to just be doing snare, because if snare hits, your TNT is just dead. But if down strong hits, they can still tech. That's the downside of moves that send downwards. Um, it will, you can just tech it and cancel all of the knockback. Oh. Um, which is a disadvantage of using down strong on stage. Even though it's a good option at like... Even if it isn't good for killing, it's still a powerful move to throw out and land with. Yeah. Oh my. Oh. Oh yeah, now. Uh, now is... At the percent that TNT was at there, I think any move would have killed. Um, just hit with anything <laughs> at that yeah. point. Oh. Oh. There it is. Got there eventually. There but there we go. Strong. That's TNT's that one, third game. Yeah, GG. Nice. GG.